Hello there, YouTube. It's your Webby3. Back with another kicking, you guessed it, action figure haul video. Today I'm trying to finish all the Black Friday stuff and whatnot that I got. Uh, first up, we are looking at The Violator. Yeah, so this is kind of, I guess I would say, Spawn's Joker. <laughs> Very cool. He's a big mega fig, and uh, like it's even hard to keep him in frame because he's so big in the box, you know? And I will be reviewing him. Everything you see today, I will be reviewing down the line on this channel, so be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. But yeah, you know I love my monsters, and I've recently been reading a lot of Spawn, so I just had to get Violator when I saw him on sale for Crema. Speaking of things I had to get, um, I saw that the NECA King Kongs, the last two, the Ultimates, were starting to uh, kind of go up in price online. So I went to Walmart and I picked up the Skull Island Ultimate King Kong. You know, there he is in all his Kingy Kongy glory. I've already reviewed the first one and the poster version. Can't wait to review this guy who comes with the pit crawler and the pteranodon, you know? Uh, as you can see here. Very cool. I think it's called Pit Monster here, but I'll be displaying him with the tree trunk accessory for sure. Very excited about that. And of course, I also picked up the uh, Empire State Building one, the New York Kong. Very cool. And I like that it comes with the big Empire State base you can display him or other Kongs on. I'll be displaying him with the shackles for sure because I didn't display my Mezco with those, so I'm definitely displaying him with them. See the shackles and the Empire State in the back? Got a big biplane that comes with him. Very cool. Flip him over, you can see that stuff on the back. <laughs> it's a really cool figure. <laughs> I like him a lot. Uh, I can't wait to pop those open and then I'll have reviewed all the Kongs. But yeah, we're going to kind of continue with uh, some more monstrous stuff. This is a real big monster haul. And this is a monster from like a superhero comic. Uh, and we got another monstrous superhero for you today. It is the SH Figure Arts Kamen Rider Black Sun. I reviewed Kamen Rider Black Sun on our other channel. A while back, that's where I review movies and TV shows and stuff. And here's where I review, like, collectibles. Uh, just reviewing different things on different channels. <laughs> oh well. But yeah, here he is, Black Sun. I really loved the show. I thought he had a magnificent design, you know? And I'm sure this will be an excellent figure. I see people posting with it online constantly. And it's been a long time since I got a figure art, so this makes me very happy. And then last but not least, the next figure is a Godzilla Store exclusive. It's the Godzilla Store exclusive, Varen, the Unbelievable. Pretty cool. He's a big guy. He's a big figure. Uh, and there's his tag. You know. I'm sure I show them all in package and with tags and stuff here, and then I show them out of package and stuff on uh, the reviews. But that's a movie monster series, Godzilla Store exclusive, Varen. So let's do a quick recap. We have the McFarlane Toys Spawn Violator Megafig, the NECA Toys Ultimate Skull Island King Kong and New York King Kong, the SH Figure Arts Bandai Japan Tomashi Nations Kamen Rider Black Sun, and the Bandai Japan Movie Monster Series Godzilla Store Exclusive Varen. So yeah, that's it. Thanks for tuning into this monstrous uh, action figure haul. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and hit that notification bell if you want to see all these reviews. I'm really itching to open a lot of these, especially Violator and the Kongs. Ooh! So I will be seeing you all uh, next time. Bye for now.